so i look crazy i know but y'all uh, we gotta talk Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kinesthetic with the Kinesthetics, and I'm here with you guys today with a new video. So, I look crazy right now. I just washed my hair and it's ear drying, but this is going to be a vlog. And this is not just going to be any vlog. This is going to be a very emotional, um, I don't even know. I just feel like emotional is the best way to explain it because the amount of emotions that I feel like I'm about to go through, mind-blowing. So... Basically, I'm getting all four of my wisdom teeth pulled. And I'm going to let y'all know why. Okay? Because it's a very big thing. So, before we go ahead and get into this vlog, make sure you guys subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a big thumbs up and drop a comment down below. Make sure y'all subscribe. We're on the road to 10K. So, make sure you guys join the family. And, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So, today is Wednesday, March 25th. And, y'all... I'm getting all four of my wisdom teeth full tomorrow. And the reason why is because I went to the dentist last week to get a cleaning. And I'm not even going to lie. I haven't been to the dentist in a hot minute. Like, I wanted to find a good dentist. Um, when I changed jobs, like my insurance change, it was just a whole bunch of consider. But I went to the dentist. I got my teeth cleaned. And the dentist was like, oh, you still have all four of your wisdom teeth. And I'm like, yeah. And basically, when they were cleaning the back of my bottom row, there was so much like build up back there and basically i have like a pocket behind my wisdom tooth that's kind of like holding things and he was explaining to me like if i left my wisdom teeth in for another six months like i most likely get an infection in my mouth and i'm like uh-uh not in this mouth honey so we're gonna take all four of them out because the way my insurance works too it just makes sense to pull all four of them at one time so a lot of people were like no just do two and two just do one at a time no i'm just getting all four done getting through the pain and calling it a day okay so tomorrow i have to go in to get them out i told them i said put me to sleep and just take all four i'm like put me to sleep and take them all so i am getting sedated while i do wow so i am getting sedated my first time ever getting sedated so I don't know how this is about to go but i just wanted to document it just so that oh my arm is getting tired just so i have it like for my reference and i was like let me go ahead and share it with you guys because i share everything with y'all so that's what we're doing but i have to do a couple of things to prepare so i just wanted to come on here and share like my preparation steps and then tomorrow i'm gonna take y'all with me my mom is coming with me so she'll be vlogging for me tomorrow because i'm gonna be a little loopy doopy so we'll see what her vlogging skills is hitting for but yeah so i'm doing work right now and i'll check in later with you guys once i start preparing hey y'all so i know i was said i was going to record as i was like preparing myself but i was just in a groove doing things so i didn't record but what i did do is i put my hands on cornrows i'm not going to show y'all and embarrass myself but i got eight meek millies under this hard scarf and then i went ahead and slicked my baby hairs a little bit to make it look and seem a little better but i just wanted my hair like out of the way because when i'm laying down tomorrow to get them teeth pulled i just want to be comfortable i don't want to have to worry about my hair like days after and once i take these braids out braid out is gonna be popping okay so i did that and i also went ahead and soaked off my gel manicure because i was instructed to come with no nail polish on so yeah i'm looking like a basic bitch right now but it's okay because in the long run it's going it's going to equate to a baddie okay so once these teeth are straight it's over for all of these holes period so i'm just here right now um i just got a new external hard drive because the one I had before ran out of space. So I'm just formatting that and like getting my content together. So with me getting my, um, do this. With me getting my teeth pulled, I had to like pre-record a lot of content. So I'm just like organizing everything now so that as I need to edit as the days go on, it's just edit and go. It's not like, you know, trying to find things, memory cards in and out. Everything is already where it needs to be. Just edit it and go. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm trying to upload like as many videos as I can for the rest of the week so I could like really relax the next few days. So that's the plan. 
that's the plan so i'll check in with you guys tomorrow morning good morning today is the day today is thursday march 26th and whoo girl i look crazy but they told me no contacts they told me no jewelry they told me no nail polish so they basically told me to pull up looking crazy okay so i'm up getting ready now i'm gonna head out and head there it's in manhattan so maybe like an hour 45 minute an hour commute so yeah i don't know how to feel i'm just trying to stay relaxed before i stay my ass home because i still have not paid for anything okay so yeah i'm just trying to stay relaxed the whole time and just you know this too shall pass god got me my father got me so yes let's go to be at all for now. So I'm just sitting here recovering with my mom. And um yeah. Um I'm just here. Mama, there was a lot um but it wasn't as bad as I expected it to be. I don't know if you guys even hear me. So I'm hungry. Yeah, I hate those tests when you have to fast. Oh. No, who's calling me? I'm still a badass. Why you say that? <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that to me. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't feel that too, person. too pretty. Mm -hmm. You scared that you were? I was scared I pressed the wrong thing. My mom's gonna fly for me. But it's okay. Yes. I felt like I was in and out of. How long did it take? An hour? One, two, two. Oh, what? Oh, and a half? I an hour and a half in there. Um. I want to show it in my mouth. Oh, um, is my face swollen? Is it swollen? Uh, not really, but you remember Kim Yun was. Bigger than yours. Yeah. But it will go down. You know you're expected to get a little. So I have a couple. I have a little gauze size in my mouth too. I have a bag with all my instructions in there. Mm -hmm. Give it to me. What were you doing while you waited for me? Huh? I was looking at my puzzles. Was there puzzles? The puzzles. Um, I don't know. 
was on my phone reading news. For as bad as I thought I would. You would fail, huh? Hmm? So they're going to send the prescription to the World Games by our house. Mm -hmm. And I guess I'll pick it up because it, since it has my name on it, I have to pick it up. Oh, do you have to start it today? Oh, that's a good question. Okay, thank you. Does she have to pick up her medication today to start? I would because when that wears off, uh -huh. yeah. I don't know what kind of pain she's going to be in. Okay. The bitch is back on the block. Hmm? Showing Kim that I'm back on the block. Period. On our way home, my kids say, girl. <laughs> It's the first night, and I've just been sleeping all day since I got home. Um, I've been eating like soft pasta, like soft, soft pasta, and drinking water. I definitely feel like the anesthesia had your girl knock the fuck out, but um, I've been like doing jaw exercises and. Um, napping. I don't have any swelling right now, I don't think. But I've been putting ice on my face for 20 minute intervals between my naps because you know your girl left her sleep. So, yeah, I'm about to take my medicine now that they prescribed me before I go to sleep for the night. But I feel more discomfort rather than pain. Like, I'm just like, my mouth <laughs> i'm not like oh my god i'm crying so yeah but i'm about to do what i have to do so i could go to bed and i'll check in tomorrow hey y'all so it's the next day so i guess we could say the full day one and i'm currently just about 24 hours post procedure and um I'm feeling okay. Like, I've been staying on top of my pain medicine so that I don't feel as much pain. As far as swelling, you guys can see I have a little swelling on this side, but not too much here. But I have been icing my face. I'm allowed to ice my face for the first 48 hours, 20 minutes on, 40 minutes off. So I've been, like, trying to, you know, stay in that routine. Um, and, yeah, I've been eating pasta, 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 pasta. And, um... This side of my face, like, I can feel, I felt the swelling coming this morning, but I've been up since, like, 6 o'clock this morning because I had to eat something so that I can take my painkillers. So, yeah, I've been staying on top of it. And as you guys may or may not know, quick confession, I don't know if I ever told you guys on my channel, but I cannot swallow pills to save my life. Like, your girl could do a lot of things, but I cannot swallow pills. So, I have to have my pills dissolve in water so that i can take them and um i've been gargling salt water eight fluid ounces with two with one teaspoon of salt in it so that's been helping a little bit too but i am currently working because i did not take any days off and um yeah so i'll check out with you guys later once i have an update but as of right now your girl is feeling good i'm feeling okay i'm not gonna say good so yeah yeah I look crazy right now, but let me show y'all. I made something else for me to have. Oh, not me stepping on my MacBook charger. So I made something else for me to have. I made a chocolate milkshake. So I put a Hagen Dazs. I forgot I had these Hagen Dazs non dairy um, ice cream bars in the freezer. So I put that in here with some Ripple Milk. Yeah so friggin delicioso so i'm happy i have something else my swelling is starting to pick up 
but I haven't been icing my face for like the past two hours because I've been working. So after I have this, I'm going to pop some painkillers, ice my face, and then probably just lay down and watch Snowfall. But y'all, this, I'm going to show y'all how I make it the next time I make it with this. Hey guys, so it is night number two since I got my teeth pulled and I'm feeling way better than I did yesterday. Like I was actually able to brush my teeth and I took myself a nice long shower. So I'm feeling way better. But I have noticed that the antibiotic has been making me feel like kind of nauseous. So even though I ate like every time before I, I take it, I eat a full plate of food. So it's not that my stomach is empty because I know if you take antibiotics on an empty stomach, it can make you feel nauseous. But yeah, my stomach has been full since yesterday. That's one thing about me. One thing about me, I'm going to eat. So I've been eating. But um, yeah, I still feel like kind of nauseous. And this side of my face, you guys can see, is more swollen than this one. <laughs> I was doing so good, y'all. And looking like a chipmunk. But I'm fine. I'm feeling fine. Um, I've been, like, doing little things to keep myself busy. So I've been editing YouTube videos. And tomorrow, I'm going to step out because I have not been out since I got my procedure. Like, if I didn't just get it yesterday. But I have to go do returns and I need to go to Sephora. So I'm going to do all of that tomorrow and I'm going to vlog as I'm out. Because I want this vlog to be more than just about my teeth, okay? So in the morning, I'm going to wake up early so that I can be on schedule with my meds. I'm going to do laundry. I'm going to prep my returns. And then I'm going to go out and run my errands. And then I'm going to come back and see what else I can get done for the day. But productivity still a must video still going up monday wednesday fridays and sunday at 12 p.m noon today is friday my upload today was kind of late but i gave myself grace because i'm like i just went through a whole procedure yesterday and i still uploaded today boss bitch shit okay so my upload for sunday and monday is already up on youtube and then i'm editing wednesday's video now so listen when i tell y'all i'm gonna be productive i'm gonna be productive that's one thing about me and I do have these two breakouts here that are responding to the benzoyl peroxide and this here. I don't know what's going on. But when it's responding to the benzoyl peroxide, it like comes up because we want our breakouts to come up. We don't want them to just stay into the skin because they, they're going to keep resurfacing. So hopefully by tomorrow, these are down. By Sunday, maybe my face could be down a little bit because I do want to record a video. But we're going to see. So I'm just taking things one day at a time. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and finish up what I'm doing on my computer. And then I want to show you guys like my nights, my night routine that I'm going to do tonight to prepare like for the weekend. So I'll be back once I get to that. All right, y'all. So I'm in bed now. Somebody's outside my window blasting music. So hopefully y'all can't hear it. But I have a couple of things that I need to do before I go to sleep. So the first thing is I want to place an order on Misguided. So I was watching Aja Nari's video, her collective black like, hole. And she got this dress and it just came back in stock. So I'm about to buy it. I don't know if I'm going to need a size 6 or a size 4. But I'd rather get the 6 and if it's too big I could just take it in on my own. But this is a dress. I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah, this is a dress. This is a dress. Okay, honey. So, I'm going to get this in a size 6. And then, I also like... Let me turn my camera so y'all can see. I also like... I don't really shop on Misguided's app. I usually shop on their website. But, I'm on their app right now. And, they have like this feature where you can swipe. Okay, how do I get out of this? You can swipe so they have like down here you click swipe and then if you like it you swipe it to the left if you left if you don't like it, you swipe it to the left if you love it then you swipe it to the right so like that and that way you could just skim through the website easy I love this because these websites be having so many pieces and um I can't keep up so I'm actually gonna save this because I have something like this yeah, these websites be having so much and I can't keep up. So I love this little feature that they have. So I'm about to go ahead and finish doing my cart. 
and then I'll be back to show you guys what I decided to get. Hey y'all, so I placed my order on Misguided. I feel stuffed. I placed my order on Misguided. I placed an order on ASOS. So y'all should already be able to tell another collective haul is coming real soon, okay? But I was laying down watching Justin LeBoy's Breakfast Club interview. Highly recommend that y'all check that out. We see him as like, you know, the tweets on Instagram, tweets on Twitter. But just hearing his story is very interesting because you see these people on social media and you just assume who they are, what their character is. But hearing him speak in the interview, I'm like, oh, wow. I have a different type of respect for him now. So if y'all didn't see that interview, check it out. I love watching me some Breakfast Club interviews in case y'all don't know. I love me a Breakfast Club interview, but I'm going to go to bed now because I'm exhausted and my mouth is starting to hurt again. So I'm going to just go to sleep so that I can catch up on my meds in the morning. So I'll see you guys then. Good morning, beautiful people. It's Saturday and I just woke up literally. I still haven't done anything yet. I feel like my swelling is more noticeable now. I don't know if it got worse or what. But um, my throat feels kind of like I need a tea. But I remember it. I can't have any hot beverages for the for the first few days after my surgery. So I think I'm going to make tea and like let it sit for a long while. Just so that I can get like the infusion of like the herbs in my throat. But, um, yeah, my mouth, I do feel pain because I still haven't taken my painkillers yet. So I'm about to brush my teeth, eat something. Is my lips swollen? My lips look a little, a little big and a little dry. But I'm going to brush my teeth, eat something so that I can take my medicine for the morning. And it's not 9 o'clock yet, babe. It is 8.34, so I'm up early on a Saturday, okay? Because y'all know I love sleeping on the weekends. Um, I don't know if it's a swelling of this cheek, but I feel the stitches on this side more. I don't know if it's my tongue motion or what, but I'm feeling the stitches, like, whenever I move my tongue. So, I don't know if that means they're coming out. Because Kim told me, like, she didn't even notice when her stitches fell out. They just, like, fell out. And she was just like, oh, shit. They're not here anymore. So, yeah. So, I'm about to do that. I'm waiting for my Zara package to come. And I need to be on it, okay? Because I need my package. And I'm going to prep my return so I could go do returns after my Zara package comes. So, hopefully FedEx hurries it up. But I'm going to go ahead and do my little morning routine. And then I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so my Zara package just arrived. Wow, my face looks crazy. But um, I'm just going to open it real quick because I'm actually getting ready to go to Zara now. So if anything needs to go back, it's going back. I don't even... Um, oh, this has to go back. I wanted another pair of these. Really? What I did it? Okay. So, I got these leggings and the top to go with it. But for some reason, I thought they were ribbed and they're not. So, they just look cheap. And these were like... These were $25. So, I just feel like this is not $25. And who's this fitting? 
Who is this fitting? Alex? My niece? Who is this fitting? Is this children's? Toddlers? Kids? <laughs> but yeah, so this is going bad. I'm gonna put this in my bag. I got this the wrong, which I am super excited about because it was sold out for so long. And let me go ahead and try it on real quick just to see what it's giving. What it's giving, giving, giving. Okay, so I gotta wrap her around. Push this through. I just posted a picture on Instagram. So I'm low-key trying to be active. Okay, so push that through. And then I think bring this around. I think this has to be like this. Not me almost ripping. Is this right? I feel like this gotta be on a cooch. I feel like this gotta be on a cooch. And these gotta be like ID. Oh, this shit got beads on there. Okay, Zara. With the details. Oh, this looks way better. I'm gonna put it down so you guys can see. Don't mind my bed, but this is it. I think it's very cute. It's giving vacation. It's giving summertime. It's giving waistline. It's giving, it's giving everything. Okay. So I plan on wearing this as like a cover up or like as a skirt with an outfit. But these are the beads that I was talking about that it has on it that I wasn't aware of. I thought it was a print, but no, girl, it's actual beads. So, and this was forty dollars, thirty nine ninety. And then I showed you guys that I got this set in my previous Zara haul. If y'all didn't see it, check it out. I'll link it up above. But I had it in a size small and y'all, um, it was too small. So I got a medium in both pieces. So let me just confirm that the medium fits. Oh, freak. I forgot I had these leggings on. Oh, but the fact that it can go up. But I'm going to try this on later because I'm already dressed to go. So, let me get myself together and we out of here. Let me figure out what I'm putting on, girl. Okay, so I changed. I just wanted to look real chill, real cute, real low-key or whatever. So, I put on this Carhartt hat that I got from Amazon. These sunnies that I got from ASOS. I have the link for everything down below. My little earrings, my little hoopty hoops. I have on this Jordan T. This jean jacket that I bought from ASOS. I think it's Free People brand. I have on these loungewear leggings from Zara that I showed you guys in my haul. And I have on my black and white zunk low. So real cute, bro. And I'm carrying my um I'm carrying my red Gucci Soho bag. Real cute. Real calm. Real collective. Going. Doing what I gotta do. And coming right the freak back home. So, yeah. Who the freak is running past my house? Or was that a bird? But, um, yeah. I'm gonna be vlogging off my phone. I'm leaving my camera home. Because it can't fit in my bag. My bag is full. I only have my mask, my lip gloss, my wallet, my other phone, and my AirPods case in here. And we are packed to capacity. Okay, baby? So, I'll be vlogging off of my phone. And, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was in Zara for 20 minutes, but I'm about to go food shopping real quick, and then I'm gonna go to Big Plaza. Can I tell y'all people are just outside to be outside? Like, I'm trying to be outside, get what I need, and go home. I was able to just pick it up at the door, so I got my fancy. Okay, so I just picked up my order at Sephora. And when I was on a line, take this down. I got so much shit. But yeah, so when I was on the line, some girl was behind me and she was telling her friend like, oh, something, something about when she wasn't feeling good. So I stepped up because I'm like, uh-uh, we're not doing this. I'm just here to pick up my friend. She can go to her home. And she's like, oh, no, 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 not right now. Like, sis, come on. But I'm about to go to Savage Shop real quick to pick up another one of those ice creams. Because I feel like I'm gonna like it for some reason. So let me pay attention and I give an over. And yeah, I'll be back in a second. Hey, to you, the birds. 
are chirping. <laughs> Let me not get started. But good morning. It is Sunday, March 28th. March 28th. And I'm up. I am ready. If y'all notice, I have some brows on because I'm about to record a video. So today I'm actually going to record my Fenty East Drop review and demo. And depending on how that comes out, then I'm going to record more videos. If I look crazy, then I am recording no more videos. So that's the plans for today. It is 12.30ish and I woke up like at 11. So I did have a late start to my day, but I did want to give you guys an update. So the reason I was able to sleep in today is because I wasn't in as much pain like the other mornings. I had to get up to take my painkillers. But this morning, your girl was Gucci, okay? So I got my teeth pulled on thursday so friday saturday so today's like day three i was able to brush my teeth this morning so i just used my toothbrush and went over the areas soft circular motions and um it was fine i am warming up my saggy ass pasta so i can eat something before i take my medicine because you know can't eat too much honestly if it wasn't for the fact that chewing helps to heal the affected areas faster I wouldn't be eating because i am tired of eating this pasta but i also started with making milkshakes which i'm going to show you guys so y'all probably like pasta and milkshake girl you gotta do what you gotta do when you gotta do what you gotta do okay so i'm about to eat my pasta and then i'll check back in to show you guys how i make my popping ass milkshake hey y'all so i found a little human i just recorded my review of the fenty beauty eavesdrop and y'all my skin look the freak good but it's milkshake time it's milkshake time it's milkshake time it's milkshake time so i'm gonna bring y'all in the kitchen with me as i make my milkshake so y'all can see the goods okay so first i'm gonna wash my hands So I'm gonna take my little cup from my blender and rinse it out. The blender I have is a Ninja. This is the one where you could like blend and go. So I could go ahead and blend this and this is a cup that I could just. The first ingredient is ice cream. This is the ice cream that I was telling you guys about yesterday. I realized I didn't really show it to y'all in the vlog, but I didn't. This is the Oatly Vanilla. This is a non-dairy frozen dessert. It's 100% vegan. It's gluten free. So this is it. They also have oat milk of this brand, but I don't really like oat milk. But this ice cream girl, look how much of it I used already and I just got it yesterday. I had to, I had to tread, oh shit, me wasting ice cream. I'm pretty sure this isn't the healthiest, but right now, it's, I have an excuse. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. Even if you don't like vegan stuff, Try it out. It's good. I'm gonna take some of this ice cream. Mm -mm -mm. You gotta lick the spoon. I'm not gonna do it on camera because y'all gonna be like, you nasty girl. Can't be wasting no ice cream out here. Now I'm gonna take my ripple milk. This is a plant-based milk. Also gluten-free. This whole milkshake is gluten-free and it tastes good. So this is plant-based. It has no nuts no soy no lactose no dairy none of that so this is my go-to milk if y'all watch my channel y'all know how i feel about this milk so y'all do sabes but i'm gonna take my cup with the ice cream and pour some milk in here but like that much now this is the part i don't know if i'm supposed to be doing but i feel like it's day three and i day three they said that you could start you know transitioning back did i say that or did they say that who's they i hate when people be like they said who's they they is me actually i'm gonna take my my lucy's chocolate chip cookies these are gluten free and i'm gonna take one and you gotta crush it up like real fine like real real fine so i take my time with this because you can't get anything stuck in the back of them teeth but i take my time i promise I'm going to show y'all how it looks after I finish crushing. So this is the whole cookie. And this is what I crushed it up to be. So I'm about to blend this joint. And 
candy is the final product. It tastes so good. Yeah, it is. This, I'm going to be making this even after my whole two situation is done. Because this, they're the one. But it's so gloomy outside. Mm. I might as well go edit this video. And then I'll be back. Hey guys, so I am back. I edited my video. Yeah, I have all of my videos for this week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. What am I saying? Monday, Wednesday, Friday videos up in YouTube captions, ads, cards, all of that. Tags. I'm so proud of myself. And it's only 6 11 p.m. And I woke up late this morning. So productivity at its finest. And this video is actually gonna be uploaded on Sunday. I edited everything up to this point. So I'm gonna keep this vlog going until Thursday just because I want to give you guys updates on my mouth and I also want to give you guys like an overview of my experience. So this vlog is going to be kind of long, I'm telling y'all now, but I make sure that with longer vlogs, like everything is substance. So like I'm not leaving in any extra stuff. So that's the plan for this vlog. But yes, this is my skin. I've had the foundation on for about five hours now. So I think it looks good. Let me put y'all up because mm, like four or five hours more four hours but a little over four hours but this is my skin and my hair if you guys are curious is a braid out so you guys saw i had those cornrows in and i just took them out and i used my tgin daily moisturizer y'all know i did sponsor content with them but y'all anything that i do sponsor content with just know that i tried it out that i like it that i believe in the brand that i believe in the product so don't think i'm out here just doing sponsor stuff sponsor stuff because if that was the case i would be doing way more sponsor stuff but i only do i only agree to do sponsor content on products that work for me products that i like for brands that i like so just keep that in mind but um i'm about to remove my makeup so that i can like just lay in bed plan my week i'm super early like i'm ahead of schedule so i'm gonna plan my week i'm going to watch some snowfall because i told myself i was gonna do that since thursday and i still haven't done it so i'm gonna catch up on some snowfall i'm still on season one don't judge me i finally started i finally got past that scene in episode one that got me upset casey i don't know the reason why i wasn't watching snowfall is because that part in episode one where the straw was inserted in places that straw shouldn't be inserted i was just like oh nah and my sister was like kim was like just watch it like it gets better like that was just one one scene so i think i'm on like episode five now and i haven't seen anything like it like that so i'm gonna keep watching but if something like that come up again then it's clipped it's over so i feel my stitches maybe i'm moving my mouth too much but um yeah, when I plan my weeks, my weeks are more smooth, my weeks are more productive, and I'm just trying to keep this momentum going until my birthday because I have goals that I want to reach. So I look crazy. But good morning, good afternoon. It's Monday, March 29th, and I'm about to do a couple of things. So one, I need to take some pictures for Instagram. Two, I'm gonna record two reels, a makeup reel and an outfit reel, and yeah so lots going on but i want to show you guys my outfit and tell you guys something very exciting <laughs> so last week right before i got my procedure done i received my first gifted pair of sneakers from nike so i got these bacon Air Max 90s and i wanted to throw them on with the outfit because i wanted to wear this outfit well i wanted to execute this outfit i didn't know how i was gonna look for Air Max day but y'all know i was <laughs> healing so my outfit is this pink sweater vest from asos you guys saw this in a previous haul that i did i'll link it up above and down below this white tennis skirt that i actually got from amazon and i'm gonna put this white dress shirt from zara underneath the pink sweater and um i want to see how it's gonna look so i'm gonna go ahead and do those things real quick and then i'll be back to show you guys how everything turns out y'all what look at how friggin' big my fro is now and i just did a trim but it's just kind of annoying because my bangs aren't bangs anymore they just here so before my fro used to you know sit nice and up now it's just 
Ugh, but I did my face. I used my Fenty Beauty um, Ease Drop again. I did a little bit more of a face this time. I love it. And I need to wash my hair later. Okay, so this is my outfit. It's my hair. My fur is so big now. My outfit. Bang, I'm just carrying my Vanity PM Louis Vuitton. Don't mind the messing back. But yeah, I'm about to go take these flicks. And then... Good morning. I look crazy. this morning like what and i just showed y'all how i got this popping puff and my face came out beat today so i'm somebody's blasting music i hope y'all can't hear it but i'm getting ready to go out with sushi right now to take some pics so i'm about to pick out my outfits real quick and yeah but thank you guys so so much for 1 million views on my youtube channel it would not be possible without you all and i'm not just saying that i mean it period thank you guys for every share thank you guys for every comment thank you guys for every like thank you guys for every video suggestion thank you guys for it all i love you guys so much and i have so much coming for you guys so i'm super excited Mwah. love you hey y'all so it is thursday april 1st happy april new month new goals new intentions new all of that but i just wanted to come on here real quick because i was editing this vlog and it's kind of long but we back to 30 minute vlogs after this hopefully but i wanted to give you guys like a full update on my wisdom tooth experience just like a brief recap so i did it last thursday so today makes exactly one week since my dental surgery and um i i feel like i'm fine now but i'm still like treading lightly so i can heal you know appropriately but i did want to tell you guys that on tuesday i did eat chicken i had some chicken empanadas and i had like some fried chicken chunks but they weren't like too too fried so i was able to eat that fine like i was chomping them down but um after that i didn't eat chicken again just because i had like enough pasta in my house to like keep making that so i can make sure i'm healing like you know appropriately and not just rushing myself back into my regular diet as you guys seen i've been drinking milkshakes i've been eating pasta i'm still doing that now i've been you know keeping up with my meds taking my tylenol two at a time i probably take it like twice a day depending on how my pain is feeling but my antibiotics i take it twice my camera battery just died so freaking disrespectful but yeah i've been taking my antibiotics and um that's about it if i missed anything if you guys have any questions comment down below and i'll be sure to answer sorry about my bed i'm doing laundry right now you know gotta start the month off right or whatever but yes i absolutely am happy with my decision to pull all four of them at the same time if i had to do this healing process twice i don't know if i would have been able to do that so i'm happy i did all four at once and yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog that's gonna be it because i don't want this video to be too too long but before you guys head out make sure you guys subscribe to my youtube channel hit that red subscribe button down below we dead on the road to 10k like oh, we're almost at 9k and i'm mind blown but make sure y'all subscribe join the family join the vibes or whatever give this video a big thumbs up and drop a comment down below and until my next video which will be tomorrow i'll see you guys later